Greenland is a landscape photographer's dream and the subantarctic even more so because you have just virgin forests, huge fjords, beautiful crystal clear water. It's unreal. My name is Ricky Chi. I'm a filmmaker and photographer, as well as a National Geographic Explorer. Well, this is indeed my first ever Lindblad expedition trip and really got thrown in on the deep end here with this Southern Odyssey expedition because it is absolutely epic. I think everybody wants to come to New Zealand, whether they know it or not. Every stop that we've taken has been a highlight. We went through Taranga. We were shuttled to Rotorua, which is essentially the heart of Maori culture. And we spent a day at the Maori Cultural Center learning about Maori history, Maori culture, the arts and crafts that have been carried on till this day. And it was amazing going in there, touring them, and seeing them actually making these pieces. We went to essentially a working sheep station. Their farm started off with these rolling hills and then it moved very quickly into these steep, steep hillsides. And it was a really beautiful place to be. Watching them drive the sheep down from the hill was just beautiful. And it was one of my favorite things to photograph the entire time. And then we got to the South Island and Milford Sound with its stunning natural beauty. You know, I was standing there right after I got off the Zodiac and just looking at it and trying to take it in and it almost felt like my eyes were tricking me because we had lucked out on such a bluebird day there. The light here is really special. It's very atmospheric, very moody here. You can experience all four seasons in a single day, like a single hour, really. So there's a lot of variability in how you shoot, even if it's the same subject. It'll look different under the different variables of light. Not only that, I love shooting the landscape of this area. My role as a photographic expert on board is to facilitate the guests in helping them have the best photographic experience that they can have, which includes not only giving presentations and lectures about the work that I've done, but also to give them one-on-one -on -one opportunities to work alongside me, to provide workshops in the field where we can just shoot together and analyze and take a look at what we're shooting and, and see how we can do better together. These experiences are challenging because it takes effort to get there. And when this effort is expended, the reward is not just the destination, but a new perspective that is shared within this community. Everybody's here to be humbled by the places that we see. And it's just really exciting to be a part of that, to be a part of something greater than just an individualistic pursuit. And here we are on Campbell Island, and we're going to hike up after this interview to go see some royal albatross. I mean, I just don't think it gets any better than this.